named Beth. I don't know where this Beth guy is, though. Oh, Beth. Is she in the gun shop, actually, now that I think about it? I think she might be there. Yeah, Beth, owner of the weapon shop. Oh, Beth. Hi there, how can I help you? Um... Can I ask you, I want to buy some, there's some, any place in town I should avoid, I have something to sell, how about, how does someone make, can I ask you some questions? What's the word on the street about missing caravans? What do you know about the death claw? What can you tell me about Decker, is there anyone, okay. Uh, what do you know about the death claw? I think that's what's taking the caravans, it could also be the Brotherhood of Steel, they're a strange bunch, some people think it's the water merchants, but they're wrong. Okay. What exactly is a death claw? The death claw is the most evil thing to rise out of the ashes after the war. Some say it's powerful ghost from the war that haunts the land. It's no ghost, it's real as you and me. It's twenty feet tall with teeth as big as your arm. It's some kind of demon that found its way here when the world was engulfed in fire. You're crazy, I should just end your misery right here and now. Do you know anything else about the death claw? Wow, do you know where it is? Do you know anything else about the Death Claw? Well, I know this old mutant in an old town named Harold. He's seen it. He's the only one that's seen it and lived. The only one that's seen it and lived? Yeah, sure, and I'm the Death Claw's daddy. Another question about the missing things. Let's get back to the merchants. The only one that's seen it and lived? Uncle Slappy over in Old Town talks about it sometimes, but he's just a crazy old fool. Okay, I'll check it out. Bye. In Old Town. Oh, here's Bob's. Now, you can blackmail him. See, I think we need to talk about Doc Morbin, some of your secret ingredients. What are you talking about? Your secret ingredients. How fresh does the corpse have to be before it develops a bitter aftertaste? Do you use mutants, humans, or a mix? Not so loud. I don't need you saying that all over the hub. I guess I was rude, have a nice day. You know, the police station is just across the street. I really should take a little walk. I can get even louder, but I can also shut up. Noise is cheap, silence is expensive. See, you can blackmail him. Now, if you do that, you lose reputation. Though it's only two points of reputation, and mine should be around 20. But at the same time... You know, the police station is just across the street. I really should take a little walk. Wait a minute. We can find a way to reach mutual understanding. Uh, sorry, no deal. Fine, what can I get out of this? Fine, what do you want me to pay? Uh... 200 bucks every five days. Fine, it's a deal. 200 bucks due every five days. I guess I'll see you in five. See, and you get 500 experience points for that. What are you doing back then? I got... To, okay, I'm calling off the panel. What? what can you tell me about Decker? He's a mean son of a bitch and don't want to mess with him. Anything else? Give me an iguana on a stick. Sure, we got a whole iguana on a stick for 20 bucks in our prime slot. Nothing for me right now. I'm on a diet. Smart choice. You could stand to lose a few pounds. Oh, rude. I got more expenses than I need. Screw this. I want all your money now. You're dead, Bob. Now, nothing by. Poor Bob. I'm not going to give him a bad time. Though he is a cannibal. I'm going to save and see what happens. Screw this, I want all your money. I think people actually start attacking me. Oh, you're dead, Bob. Forget it, done. Now, I think since he hit at me first... Bob, for being a cannibal... Goodbye. Out of combat. No, I'm thinking people are going to kill me. Is it this guard? 
guard's gonna come after me. Yep. Can't kill Mr. Bob. Who's attacking me? Well, you can't kill Mr. Bob. Thank God we saved. Uh, I got more experience. Nothing by. Well, I'd kill your cannibal butt, but apparently that is not an option. Right, so we need to head over to Old Town, wherever that is. I think it's over here. It's this Old Town. High Towers guards. I don't know who the hell t High Towers are, to be honest. I'm going to check this bookshelf, though. Nothing. Oh, there's another bookcase here. Nothing. And this is a bathroom. Right. Well, I don't need to be in a bathroom. So I guess we'll leave. George the door guard. Okay, there's nothing to do over here then. This is obviously the wrong place. Not Ian. Rick, a guard. Nothing to do there right now. Now, he does have a quest. Um, we're not going to go do that yet, though. Because I'm looking for... Some other stuff. Nothing! Okay, let me think here. That's the police station, if we wanted to talk to Green. Let's try further south, maybe, or... We could try over here. Let's go over here. Oh, come on, where am I at? I'm trapped in a house. There we go. Come on, let's try up and to the right here. What is this way? Is this old town? There's Skag, whoever he is. Now we don't want to come here till later. Just remember that house is there. Hello, who are you, Slappy? Oh, we heard about him. Ooh, pretty, pretty stuff. What? Why is the moon? Beth told me to talk to you about the Death Claw. Beth, Beth, Shoe Sha Beth. Like Harold, you talk. Harold, Harold, tell you stories. Slappy, help then. Okay, I'll go talk to Harold first. Is Harold inside? Yeah, there he is. Give me the sugar, baby. What? No. Harold. Spare change, old friend, old pal. Can you help a poor mutant down on his luck? <laughs> I didn't know he was a mutant. I thought he was a goal. Okay, then. He doesn't look like a mutant. He only looks like a goal. Uh, sorry, I don't have any money on it. I need info on the death claw. I heard you're the man. <sighs> Uh, if it catches up with me, I want to know what to do. I'm going to kill it. I am going to kill it. Okay. Well, it's like a damn big man is what it is. Got spikes and claws that can cut through the heaviest armor. But don't let the size fool you. It's quick. 
Any weaknesses? Well, from what I've heard, maybe whack it in the head. I'd try the eyes. Of course, there's a problem there. What kind of problem? You can't look at them. It is said the Death Claw can hypnotize just by looking. Then it walks up and boom, you're it. Great, thanks. To you. You're gonna need it. Could be. Death Claws are quite a beast. Come on. People, out of the doorway. I wish to leave. Now will you take us to the Death Claw? Uh, I talked with Harold the Death Claw. Sounds pretty nasty. What can you tell me about it? Death Claw, Death Claw, da da, Death Claw. Come on, what do you know about the Death Claw? Scary, really scary. Look neat, though. Want to see it? You can get to the Death Claw? Yeah, Death Claw, Death Claw. Go see the Death Claw. Uh, take me there. Right, so the Death Claw. Now, he might actually be a pain. I am saving. Death. Let's see if we can deal with it. I'm pulling out my weapons now. In fact, no, not that one. Do we have anything better than a Magnum? Shotgun? Probably wouldn't be too bad. We got a few of those. I don't think I have anything better than... I don't know if shot... I'd do well with a shotgun, to be honest. But we'll switch it just in case. We might be able to pull it out. Might be useful. Where's the Death Claw? There it is. Now, this is going to be interesting. That is for sure. Now, they're supposed to be able to sense you from fairly far away. So, I'm saving here. Before we're sensed. There he goes. They have quite a bit of action point as well. Was hit for five hit points. Well, this actually might not be much of an itch issue because we've actually got a bunch of companions with us, to be honest. Ooh, but he's right up on me. Shoot him in the eyes. Has hit for three points. Well, that didn't work exactly, did it? Please don't run up and hit me. I don't want to be hit. Hit him for 25 points. I shot him point blank range. I was about to say, did he just kill Tycho? But he didn't. We shot him point blank range in the face. With a gun. And he shrugged it off. Dogmeat comes in. Bites him, and he's like, oh, ow. I don't understand that. Torso. I just shot dog meat. That's no good. Now, Tycho might be dead. Right. He's missed a couple of times. Used stem pack. Good. Reload shotgun, then kicks him. This is not going well, I'd say. Need six action points, right? In fact, let's switch weapons. I don't have five either, do I? No. Turn then? Let's see what happens. Don't kill Tycho. He's still going. Man, this guy is full of just... Let's try an aim shot at the torso. Did I just kill Ty... Wow. Aim shot at torso, kills Tycho. You just shot dog meat twice. Oh dear. This is not gonna go well. 
I'm just gonna load now. That was going nowhere. Plus, I was gonna load regardless, because I don't want Tycho to die. Well, that went about as well as the Titanic, I'd say. Everyone was dying. Nine percent. Nope, not gonna go for it. I am gonna get out of the way, though. Critically missed and his weapon dropped. Good job there. Alright, so we're looking right up and personal right at this death claw. Torso shot, 95% chance. Hit for 9 hit points. Turn. Yeah, go pick up your weapon. Come on, then. Ooh! Was critically hit straight off of his feet. Critically hit for five. A serious wound is inflicted. Let's see here. Torso. For 11 hit points. For one hit point. Three hit points. Why is he right after Tycho? He does not like Tycho at all. And you shot dog meat. Good job. Alright, I think I was doing more damage with the, the handgun, to be honest. Seven hit points. I'll go ahead and reload. Turn. No damage. Three hits. Eight, nine. Tycho was killed. No. Are we even nearly doing any damage to this dude? Let's investigate. You see it has 147 of 225 HP. Right. And we're only doing six, six damage every turn or show. Little bit of, I can't speak English apparently today. This isn't going well. Mmm. It would help if I could actually, you know, use another shot, but I can't. Ow. Hit for 12 points. Tyco, you gonna join in on this? There you go. And right as Tyco actually joins in, the Death Claw goes straight for him. That Death Claw has something against Tyco. For real. Holy crap. And I'm not gonna be able to use a turn out of that. Hit for 13 points, doing it. Dang it, busted another rib. Okay. Ooh, 20 points. Not bad. 158 out of 225 HP. How about Tycho? 45 is 60. He was hit. Come on, get off of him. He used a stim pack though. But tried to kick kick the death claw. Okay, you did four damage to him. I did seven. I'm gonna reload.
Come on, get off of him. He was just hit for like 20 something, 22? 22 HP? That's ridiculous. What is, what is he at now? 113 of 225. He's at 25. Ugh. I'm gonna save on death two. Let's see if we can deal with him this time. I'm gonna pull out the, the shotgun and see what I can do with it. It's hit for eight points. Not bad. That's him dead. Right? No? Not yet. He needs to be healed, though. See, he's not getting any damage done, though. Couldn't get there in time. No! I was standing there with the stem pack ready. And what's what's he at now? Oh, well that's great. I guess I won't be seeing what he's at. He's after me now though. Ow, that hurt. What was that for? Seventy two HP left. Run away. Now, why'd you hit dog meat? Ow. I was killed. Hmm. Death claws, gotta love them, right? Let's see then. I'm going to try and heal Tycho up real quick before he gets killed. I should still be in range. The real question is can I heal him? If I can heal him, use on Tycho. Use the stem pack on Tycho. Ooh. Really? 54 hit points. Holy crap. This dude. It has 69 HP left, though. Let's see if we can get Tycho to survive. Can't get there. See if I can actually get there and heal him. I'm pretty sure that hit that he got on him was probably a critical. So it's probably also likely he won't get that same hit again. Turn? I'm in between them. Ooh, knocks him to the ground. Nice. He's still right after Tycho, though. He he dodged me, dodged around me to go for Tycho. This guy has something against Tycho. Dear Lord. But that was a nice hit by... Now get off Tycho. Okay. Is the Death Claw dead? 
Critically hit for 60. Even the beast seems phased by this stunning attack. Nice. What's he at? 17 HP? What are you at? 8 HP? Uh, I'm not sure what to do. Death 2. We, we should be able to get him this time. Can I deliver a killing blow to the head? Nice. There we go. Death Claw destroyed. Now then, nothing to loot off of him, but if we come over... What are you? Eggshells? Combat. Out of combat. If we come over here, though, for crushing your enemies, you earn a thousand XP points. Dying Mutant. It was so fast, my brothers were gone, could not help. Who are you? I, I, I can't remember. Was the leader of it, maybe my holodisc. The mutant weekly hands you a bloody holodisc. Where did you come from? We were scouting for primes. Came from, from the northwest. Who sent you? Father, where are you, father? Yes, master. The mutant breathes his last breath and collapses. That is a hint towards the end of the game. Do, 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 do. But we should have a hollow disc that we just picked up off of him. Alright. It weighs about one pound. You see a disc with some strange markings on it. Can I use it? You see a disc uh, pit boy displays downloading data. Alright, let's check our pit boy then. Status. Mutant transmissions. Message, message sent. Base. This is Scavenger Team 2. Come in. Over. Message received. We're re reading you loud and clear. Go ahead. Over. Message sent. We have collected four males, two females, and their supplies from the caravan. And they're not too badly contaminated. Tell the lieutenant that we're sending them ahead. They might be able to survive the process. We're going to wait here for a few more days. Roger that. Were any casualties accrued accru during the acquisition over negative another clean sweep base also tell scavenger team one uh that we've run across the same problem they had one of our scouts did not return from his perimeter patrol a few of our other scouts reported that, that there was something big and fast seen near our camp last night i'll be checking it over personally at 0600 hours tomorrow morning over copy we'll be waiting your awaiting your report if possible, try to capture it. Master would be very pleased. Over. Interesting. So we see the arrival of a person named the Master. Interesting indeed. Now. I'm going to save. Because we killed the Deathclaw. Let's head out of here. Because that's everything in this cave. There shouldn't be anything else. Just a bunch of bones. And that thing really is a mutant. What we saw earlier was a ghoul. I don't care what it said. Out we go. And we want to go to... Downtown? Oh, we want to also put up in... Never use your weapon, town. We need to go talk to the Fargo Traders. Fargo Traders. Yo, Butch. Well, what do you got for me? What was I supposed to do again? It was mutants. What? Do I look a crate shy of a load? Did you even see the Death Claw? Been there, saw that, killed it. I'm telling you, it wasn't the Death Claw. Been there, saw that, killed it. You, you killed it? Well, I, uh, um, uh, where did these mutants come from? I don't know yet, but they have an outpost in the mountains. An outpost? Well, um, well, uh, I'll have to talk to the committee. Yeah, yeah, they'll know.